Patients in BC can rest assured they're protected from influenza because all healthcare providers in the province are now required to be vaccinated for the flu or wear a surgical procedure mask during influenza season for patient safety and quality care. Influenza immunization is the most effective way to protect those receiving care from getting influenza. Failing that, the surgical procedure mask protects patients, residents, and clients from unimmunized infected healthcare workers who are asymptomatic carriers and have no symptoms. Surgical procedure masks are effective in source reduction because the mask captures the majority of the large droplets that are the vehicle by which influenza is spread. The influenza season typically occurs from December 1st to March 31st. Once influenza season is declared by the provincial health officer, all healthcare workers who have chosen not to be immunized or who are unable to be immunized because of a medical exemption will be required to wear a mask in any facility where patient, resident, or client care is provided. Staff who have chosen not to be immunized against influenza or who are medically exempt should remove a surgical procedure mask from the box by grasping the ties or loops on the mask. Place the mask over your nose, mouth, and chin before pinching the metal clamp firmly around your nose. Finish up with complete hand hygiene with either alcohol-based hand rub or soap and water. It's important to remember to change your surgical procedure mask whenever it's moist or soiled. Change your mask immediately upon entering or exiting a patient's residence or client's environment who is on precautions. Do not leave your mask dangling around your neck. Upon touching or discarding a used mask, wash your hands or use an alcohol-based hand rub. Dispose of used masks in an appropriate waste receptacle. A surgical procedure mask doesn't have to be changed between patients unless they are on precautions. If you see a coworker who has not been immunized but is not wearing a surgical procedure mask, gently remind them to wear their mask so they don't transmit infections. Please encourage each other to comply with all aspects of the influenza protection policy, including proper hand hygiene, respiratory etiquette, and staying home when sick. Thank you for keeping our patients, residents, and clients safe from healthcare worker transmitted influenza.